Hello and welcome back to another episode of Twig. Um, in this week's episode, there's quite a few cool new changes in Galaxite. Um, and also I'm going to be talking a bit uh, at the end about what is going to be in Season 2. So, as always, I'll begin the episode by just putting the change logs on the screen now so you can pause the video and read them if you want. So, the new items in the shop this week are the rare Sticky Note Avatar, the rare Car Call, the epic Can't Touch This title, the rare Plank Gravestone, the rare Surprised Confused Taunt, and the legendary Beekeeper Avatar. Before I get into like all of the like in-game changes, I'm gonna quickly go over uh, something else, which is like uh, if Galaxy have changed like uh, some of the like requirements and like perks for uh, like to do with the influencer rank, um, because it, you you used to have to have uh, at least thirty thousand subscribers on your main channel, which was like way too high. Everyone everyone was um, like talking about how it was very high. Um, but they've changed that now. Now you only need uh, a minimum of 2,000 subscribers and like, there's a bunch of other requirements. Um, and yeah, they've also changed some of the uh, some of the picks and stuff. I'll just put like a screenshot from their website like on the screen now. You can like read some of the stuff. It's like the picks and the requirements. Um, yeah. So another thing I'm going to talk about uh, in like this uh, this video is probably like the biggest like like it's the main focus of uh this content update um and and that's promotions well the first of the two promotions in galaxy at the moment it's probably the smaller promotion um is for creative plus um like uh on the left there's another one of them things where if you punch it um you get free stuff um and you the free stuff you get it's just one avatar this time uh it's uh like it's basically like a little robot thing like the thing that's on the promotion uh, it's got a pretty wide head it's kind of strange but it is a cool looking skin um and you get it <laughs> completely free if you just punch a thing so yeah um and also uh the behind it there's like a big tower and it's got like some little like parkour thing in it it's pretty easy parkour uh just like basic jumps and then uh, yeah if you get to the very top of the tower uh you can get a free title uh which is the master builder title uh so yeah you might as well get that too so the second promotion is uh for something called totems and there's quite a few new things in galaxy for this promotion so the first thing is that there's two new maps in uh planets um, the first one is only in solo and duo. Uh, it's called Elder Springs. It's like that's like the background footage for this video at the moment. Um, it's a decent map, although one thing I will say is I don't really like it for side rushing because uh, you need two sets of blocks to get to the person next to you. Um, but yeah, that's just like my opinion. Um, and then next thing is that in quads there's a map called Painted Cliffs. Um, I do really like this map. Uh, it's really cool with like big like cracks in the ground in the middle. Although uh, like rush in the middle for emeralds is quite overpowered on that map. Um, but yeah, um, both both of these maps like haven't been built by Blockception. They've been made by uh, the Misfit Society, who like they they are the ones that made the totems thing. Um, but yeah, so I don't really know if these maps are going to be in the game forever. They might be, they might not, I don't really know. They might just be in the game for this promotion, but I'm not entirely sure. Um, and one thing that's really annoying is that, uh, like, up in the sky, there's, like, big promotions for the totems thing, uh, which is, like, kind of, like, annoying, but, yeah. And the second part of the promotion is that there's, like, an avatar hunt sort of thing um, in the hub. Um... Basically, there's like different like clues leading you to different like things that you can get like free avatars and like uh, free core at the end. Um, although it is pretty hard to do. Um, so yeah, the the three different avatars are like the first one is the priest, the second one is the elder priest, and the last one is the zealot or zealot. I don't really know how to pronounce it. And yeah, and also with with that last one, you get a, a musical heart core. Um, and yeah, it's 
like basically it's like a hunt for like hearts or whatever by uh, follow, following clues and stuff the first one is like right behind the totems thing on the right of the hub um it's really obvious just uh, some basic parkour to get to to get to it um and that's the first one that'll give you a clue and then like uh, it's like a trail but it's only three different things um and yeah yeah and, and i can't tell you like where the locations of the things are because that's kind of spoiling the fun but yeah if you follow the clues that that's all you need to do um one thing i will say is it's kind of strange because if you go to like the achievements thing um in your hot bar in the hub um it says like one out of one like the uh, totems thing uh so i don't know if that means like there's going to be more. I don't think it, 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 it there will be more. But it is kind of strange that it is there in the achievements. And it says like one out of one. So that's it for like all of the promotion stuff. Um, so yeah. Uh, now I'm going to move on to like season 2 stuff. Like what is going to be in season 2. Um, before I go into that. Um, like there's. Uh, for the last week of uh, season 1. Um. Like, there's a double XP, uh, like, before there was, like, a double XP weekend. Now it's, like, I think it's, like, a full week, like, up to season two. Um, it's going to be double XP. I did sort of, like, have an idea. Like, it, it, like I did think it might happen. There might be, like, double XP at the end of the season. And, yeah, there is. Um, so, yeah, now's the time to be on, uh, like, grinding for XP uh, to get, like, the last things in the in the battle pass that you've not got maybe getting like an extra prestige or something um yeah um but yeah like and i think that's made like the play count go up as well it might be that it might be other stuff but yeah the play count is up at the moment um so yeah that's pretty cool so now it's time for speculating about what is going to be in season two uh, like next week uh it's season two is coming out uh, next Thursday, so it's very exciting. Um, and like now, I'm just gonna like share some of my thoughts about what is gonna be in season two. Um, and so yeah, the first thing I would say it's like obviously got to be the vault. Um, it's been there for an entire season. It's slowly been like ticking up with the lights lighting up, um, and it's only in the past few weeks that it's actually got the, got to the top. It's like probably got to open. Uh, season two like i'm 99 percent like sure it's gonna open like i don't know anything for a fact but like it's probably gonna happen like just by like looking at like the lights and stuff and what's done and, yeah so the next thing um like lots of people go on about how uh, galaxy only has three games and um i'm pretty sure there's gonna be a new game in season two i mean it might be a little bit after season two i don't know but I think it'll probably be, um, like, as Season 2 comes out, there'll be a new game. Um, because, like, staff and stuff have, like, mentioned uh, they're testing a, a new game at the moment. Um, and, like, they've been testing it for, like, a few weeks now. Probably a bit longer. Um, but, yeah. Um, they, I'm pretty sure there's going to be a new game either, like, next week when Season 2 comes out. Or... Um, a little bit after um, I don't really know exactly what um, what this new game is going to be or like what it's going to be about um, but like uh, in the past it was like about like a month ago now uh, like there was some mention of like a very PvP oriented game um, so I don't know if like it's going to be like that I don't know anything about what the game's going to be but yeah, um, yeah, uh, that's that's all I know about uh, the possibility of a new game in season two. So the last thing I'm going to talk about in like what might be in season two is like different items that could be in season two. Um, the first thing, like obviously, um, there's the pick slot contest, uh, up to three winners. Um, it's, they're probably going to come out like in season two. So yeah, that's like. <laughs> yeah there's going to be new pick slots for fill the gaps um like from the winners of this contest um so yeah that they'll be coming out so there's two um discord emojis uh from the galaxy discord that people are sort of like talking about they, they could be possible season two like skins or like items or whatever 
the first one is a pineapple thing um at first when i first saw it i thought it might be end up being like a planet's core or something but i don't really know now because there's now like a pineapple core from um from one of the promotions um so i don't really know that might be something in season two but i'm not entirely sure what it might be uh it might be something that you use in the new game that might be coming out i don't really know that is a possibility um and in the next thing is there's another discord emoji uh well there's three different ones i'm pretty sure uh, but like they're all like of this witch skin um and i'm pretty sure this is gonna come out in season two uh, it might be like in the shop it might be uh in the battle pass i don't really know it might be like the main skin in the battle pass where you like get the different stages i don't know but i have seen in game um alex the owner of the server using this skin in game so we know it's like an it's there's an avatar of of this witch in the game so like it's probably going to come out um so yeah that's something like really exciting um so yeah so that's it for this episode of twig if you enjoyed it please leave a like and uh if you're excited for season two please subscribe because i'll be making videos about season two as well um so yeah bye